You're watching Disney XD on YouTube. It's Meep. Meep. What's wrong? Meep. Wow. Cool ship. Is that yours? Meep. Say what now? <coughs> Run! Hi, Phineas. Run. Wait, Candace. Okay, Candace, what did you want me to see? I'm going back for Candace. What's going on? Run! Run! Ah! Meep. Oh no, Meep, you lost your translation mustache. The spaceship is right behind you. Le vaisseau spatial est juste derrière. Hey, look, there's Mom. Your children are climbing in the spaceship now. Hi, Mom. Vos enfants montent maintenant dans le vaisseau spatial. We're going to outer space. Oh, for the love of, would you turn around? See ya. Oh, my God. Well, when is that ever going to come up in conversation? Hi, Mom! Check me out! I'm flying away in an alien spaceship with Phineas and Ferb. I am so busted! Autopilot, engage. Emergency translation mustache activated. I beg your pardon for all the hustle and bustle, kids. It's just that my planet needs your help. We'd do anything for you, Meep. In a rather large nutshell, here's my problem. You see, where I come from, cuteness is valued above all else. And the source of our planet's cuteness is a very rare element called cutonium. And a very long time ago, back in the days of yore, a gentleman by the name of Zachariah Yore discovered a hidden underground vein of pure cutonium. Yore used this highly concentrated cutonium to turn himself into a being so dadgum cute that no one could refuse him anything he desired. But as we all know, Absolute cuteness corrupts absolutely. Yor quickly became a greedy, evil tyrant who, after a great war, was eventually removed. Afterwards, pure cutonium was deemed too dangerous, and the last of it was gathered up in a special container and blasted off the planet into deep space. However, a week ago, scientists discovered a long, long dormant trail of cuteness leading away from our planet in the direction of Earth. Children and Candace, I need your help. Someone else wants to lay his hands on the cutonium, and we have to find it first. No problem. Ferb and I can build another cute tracker with these parts. Of course, this time I'll have to adjust the settings to ignore Meep's cuteness. Oh, and yours too, Isabella. I don't need your charity. So how bad is this guy we're up against? I think you're already acquainted with the scoundrel in question. Ha! Those kids will lead me right to it, just as I planned. What? What's that look? That was my plan. Yes, even destroying the pod walker was part of the plan. You know, I can deactivate the both of you, and two more just like you will take your place. That's better. Now, let's get after those kids before they get too far ahead of us. Big Mitch, but some people call him Big Mitch. I don't get it, Meep. Did Big Mitch escape from prison? Well, we come from a cute base society. By law, the harshest judicial sentence we can pass down is a timeout. Nice work, Ferb. The Cute Tracker 2.0 is up and running. So, where are we headed? It says that the Cutonium is somewhere in Seattle. How will we know when they get to Seattle? We're here.